I forgot to offer y'all some. I offer y'all some of the one I haven't bit off of. Okay. Your whole piece. My hands clean. Here you go. You gotta hurry up now. Like Billy D say, you're gonna make my arm fall off. He say, hand, hey, whatever. Been a while since I've seen late scene with the blues. If you don't know what that is, make yourself a movie night and put it on with Diana Ross and Billy D. Williams. Oh, and what's in there? Mmm. Mmm. The one and only Richard Pryor. Mmm. If you thought that Tina Turner movie was good, honey, you got to see this movie. What's up, my hoodies? Welcome to Tommy Bites. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I want to thank each and every one of you, new and old subscribers. And if you have not subscribed, what you waiting on? Go ahead and hit that red button. Then click your notifications. Like this video. Share this video. Comment down below in this video. Today we are having, and I already did my thumbnail, y'all. Um, we are having fried fish, which I did myself, and spaghetti, which I did myself, and some applesauce on the side, because that's just how I have to have my spaghetti. I just have to do it. And of course, I'm drinking out of my Pioneer Cup lemonade. Mm-hmm. And I can't forget my Texas Pete knocks you off your feet. Boom! I'm so ready. Oh, I ain't said grace, y'all. I'm just ready to eat. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food we're about to receive. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. I think I'm doing pretty good on uh, getting it going. So, you know, I do a lot of talking before I start eating. And, of course, I got me some water if this lemonade just don't do it. Because, you know, water, water, water. That's what I'm talking about. Bring this over here to me. Well, can y'all see it? Can y'all see it? I hope you can. Because I need to eat it. Oh, first bite. I should have made me some B-Lux sauce just to go for this fish. Last time it was so good. Mm. Still good though. I said, oh, I should do another no utensil challenge. I don't know if y'all can see the steam coming up from these noodles. I snapped out of that real quick. Girl, are you crazy? Mm. I wonder if the kids will notice I did something different with these with the uh, spaghetti today. Cause I usually put like um I usually put uh a little bit of sugar in my sauce. Well, I'll put this back here. 
is how I like to eat it. But I didn't have any regular sugar, y'all. I used the, the last little bit making my Kool-Aid. My lemonade. I had to use a little bit of brown sugar. I never did that before. Y'all, it tastes good. To me, it tastes better. Offer y'all some of the one I haven't bit off of. You know, whole piece. My hands clean. Here you go. You gotta hurry up now. Like Billy D say, you gonna make my arm fall off. But he say hand, hey, whatever. Been a while since I've seen late scenes of blues. If you don't know what that is, make yourself a movie night. And put it on with Diana Ross and Billy D. Williams. Oh, and uh, what's the name? Mm. Mm. The one and only Richard Pryor. Mm. If you thought that Tina Turner movie was good, honey, you got to see this movie. Myself and look at it again. Because I'm not going to the movies tonight. You know, my son want to see Hobbs and Shaw. I just don't like being crowded in the movie theater. kid that like to hang out. That's a good thing, I guess. I ain't got to worry about eating no mess. Mm. He's so on I don't want to do anything that's going to jeopardize my higher education. I wish I had that mindset when I was that age. I didn't think about future like that. And then they don't think they really promoted a lot of things when I was coming up. Got to ask y'all how y'all day was. Really? What'd you do? Are you going anywhere? Oh, happy Friday! I'm throwing off by the days of the week because my son had football practice today. They don't normally have football practice on Fridays, but today is the first day of the official football practice. <coughs> I feel like I'm choking. Okay. You ever had something just sitting there like a piece of food and you could feel it and it's like, oh God, I don't want to choke. Mm. So that was throwing me off by the days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week. This is how we taught the kids in preschool days of the week days of the week 
Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. It's Sunday and it's Monday. It's Tuesday, then it's Wednesday. It's Thursday, then it's Friday. And then it's Saturday. Days of the week. I used to love it. They be waiting on that song. I will always think of a song that will help them remember what I need them to remember. I kind of miss it. I want to sub, but I'm like, can I really sub? Cause it's gonna really, is it gonna mess with my time? It should be okay once the school starts back though. I should be able to do it. Cause right now they practice is all crazy. It's at 7.45, they gotta be there at 7.30 to 11. And then I go back and I pick them up. And tomorrow, they practicing tomorrow. Tomorrow's Saturday. I got to get up at 6.30 or 6 o'clock because he didn't fix himself nothing to eat this morning. He usually just eat like one, excuse me, one pack of um, oatmeal and go on because he don't want to eat nothing heavy, but he don't want an empty stomach either. And then he'll go practice. But the day he said he didn't do that. So my head itch. So um I'm like, okay, I'm gonna have to get up in the morning, throw them biscuits in the oven, and um cook some breakfast sausage for them. Sugar. Nasty. I'd rather eat a um an apple and I'm not I don't eat apples like that. I used to when I was a little girl, I think. But now but this meal reminds me of y'all. It reminds me of when I was a little girl. When we was growing up, you know. Really, she did it when we was in the projects, and she did it when we finally moved out of the projects. I was like in fifth grade, and she moved in with her boyfriend, and he had a huge child. So for us, that felt like a mansion child who come from the project too. Um, but every Friday, it's like I feel like I have something on my chin. Every Friday. I looked forward to every Friday, not just because I didn't have to go to school the next day, but I have some stuff on my walls in here because I can hear my echo. Let me cut this volume down. Okay. I don't want to be like crazy sounding. Um, I knew that my mom was going to make spaghetti. She was going to fry some chicken. She was going to definitely fry some fish. And she bring home this thing, a uh, tray about this big. This is, it wasn't a Dunkin' Donuts and it wasn't uh, Krispy Kreme. It was Piggly Wiggly up the street from us. And they had like, um, they would sell like the real thick donuts. Maybe that's why I don't like the donuts, thick donuts now. Well, dang, that fish good. I forgot my bread. Mm. 
thought I said I wasn't going to eat no bread. I just knew that every Friday, that's what we was going to have. She'd be in the house playing the music. Sometimes her sisters would come over. And they would just be listening to, um, well, they're oldies now, but they'd be listening to all the good songs. They're still good. I still listen to them. Those were some good days. And I'm like, have I done enough when my kids can look back when they get older and say, oh, I remember, this reminds me of my mom. Oh, I remember my mom used to do this. Now, granted, I didn't have all good days when I was growing up. I my mom used to beat my butt. But I, you know, I was bad. Well, what's that word? I was rambunctious. Is that it? Just straight on bad, that was it did. Anyway. Anyway, sometimes I wish I still had that free spirit. Now I think I think too much before I do. I mean, which is a good quality to have. You don't want to be out here acting a total fool. Because I be saying stuff on TV and I'm like dang my kids say I embarrassed them can you imagine had I started fighting somebody because my fries was cold do you know how many times I'll be fighting in the restaurant that's crazy Hippos in church. And don't tell her I said this. How you gonna keep us in church, but then as soon as you mad at, at us for something, you gonna cuss us out? Is that God like? <laughs> oh my God. I love my mama though. But seeing her get older is a blessing, but after seeing my aunt who passed away <clears throat> this year, I don't know. I hope that I can be as strong. That was very close to my aunt growing up when I was younger. But you know, when we get older, we start getting busy. But I would still talk to her as much as I could. And her heart kids are having like a some kind of memorial thing for her tomorrow. On Saturday, I mean, because I don't know when this video comes out. And I'm like, I want to go, but I don't want to go. And I probably won't go. I 
I'm pretty sure one of my sisters is going to be there. So if my mother needs support, they can be there. Now school is around the corner. Glass just make it taste better. But that thing is good. Good, good, good. I wish I had square ice come out of my own ice maker. But I'm just glad I got an ice maker, right? Some people don't have ice maker. Be thankful, Tommy. Mm. Oh, Lord, what happened to my fish? I said I'm going to eat two pieces. Child, I don't about ate them all. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to save that piece right there. Because when I make my, that grits in the morning for my son, I'm going to kind of put a fish in it. I love fish and grits. I do. Well, stuff is good. She like the time go fast. But if I'm eating something and it didn't turn out like I thought it was going to turn out. But I'm still eating it because I need to make a video. I mean, time be moving like a snail. Sundays is usually my movie night. But I'm going to see if I can find a movie to look at. Y'all, I have sat on the couch one Sunday. I don't know what it was. Something on Netflix. Netflix gets you every time. Well, I only did it more than once. I started early in the morning and was still on the couch. Minus a couple of breaks. Oh my god. That is so good. I'm gonna finish up this fish and then I'm gonna be done. Mm. I didn't realize I ate that much of that fish. I think my son like these better because it's like the last bag of fish that I got was the same kind as these, the whitings, but they were they were like the fillets and they were in a a single bag or something. He didn't really like those because it's like really thin. And he saw these right before I, I had everything laid out to prep. I had my base my cornmeal and then I had the fish over in the pan. Excuse me. It's like where you get that fish from? Like I meant fishing or something. I said the store. Well, we done ate up all our catfish that we caught. And what we didn't eat I gave it to my mom. She was supposed to make some catfish stew, but I just didn't feel like going over there to get it. Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is good. I'm full. Can I eat another bite? I tried to make a cake. I didn't let it sit long enough before I flipped it.
still tastes good though. I made a lemon cake, but I put some some rum extract in it. It tastes good. I ain't gonna have some taste. <sighs> I had the real rum. So y'all, I don't think I'm gonna make it to thirty. I can't do it today. So remember, you know, trust yourself, love yourself, uh, love others, spread the joy, spread the love, um, be kind to yourself and be kind to others. Tell yourself you love yourself and tell someone else that you love them, but mean it. Don't just say it to say it. Let's not just throw that word around. Who is blowing a horn? Jesus. I'm glad when school start back. Oh my God. This idiot. Y'all hear that? I know it's time for me to go. So remember, I love you and God loves you. Take care. I will see you on the other side of tomorrow. Peace. Smooches. I'm so not left handed. I don't know why I did that. But it is what it is. And it ain't what it ain't. And it gonna be what it gonna be. Thank you.